Hey guys, this is Colton with 3D Mats, and today we're gonna to show you how to install our universal car roof rack. There's a lot of different ways that this can be configured depending on your vehicle, so hopefully we make it super straightforward for you guys and get you up and running here really quickly. All right, first up, what you need to identify is the shape of the roof railing that your vehicle has. Note that you cannot install this roof rack if your vehicle has no roof rails or if those roof railings are completely flush with the top of the vehicle. Now the roof rack comes with four types of clips to attach to your vehicle's railing, labeled A, B, C, and D. Consulting the manual shows that the shape of our railing will best match the C clip and D clip. The D clip was already installed onto the adjustable caddy, so we just needed to swap the A clip with the C clip by simply removing the screws. As you can see, there are various sets of hole widths, so make sure you install this clip into the set of holes that will allow the clip to fit the width of your railing. Next, remove each caddy from the crossbar by first using the supplied keys to remove the anti-theft cover. Then, remove the plastic plug from each end of the bar, and then loosen each bottom screw on the caddies, which will enable them to slide out the end of the crossbar. Finally, you're going to remove the black rubber lining from underneath each crossbar. Now measure the distance between your roof railings. Make sure to subtract the length of each caddy from that measurement you just got. For us, it ended up being six inches total that we subtracted from our measurement. Now take that measurement and cut the rubber insert to length to ensure that the roof rack will fit perfectly onto your vehicle. Once you've reinserted the rubber strip, caddies, and plugs back onto the crossbars, lift them into place on top of your vehicle. They don't have to be perfect, just get them into place to make adjustments later. The recommended spacing for the crossbars is 36 inches to give you the best support for your mounted accessories. On the outside of each caddy, loosen each clip screw until you can adjust the metal clip to slide out of the current tray into the correct tray so that the height of the clip is allowing it to properly grip your vehicle's railing. Then retighten the screw until snug and reattach the anti-theft cover on each caddy. Now you're all set up and you can attach any further accessories to the roof rack. So if you have any more questions about the universal car roof rack from 3D Mats, check the link in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching.